Hey guys, welcome back to the Cherry Bakers. And it's only me for now, but in one hour Alexis will be coming around. But today I'm gonna to show you how to make scrambled egg on toast. So here's what you'll need. You'll need one jug, two eggs, salt and pepper, bread, butter, one spoon and one fork. So, first, first of all, you'll need to crack your egg, oh God, in there. So I've already literally just cracked one egg and I didn't realize. So, there's one egg. And then you'll need to crack the second egg. So now that you've cracked, whoa, that's in a weird shape. Oh well. Right, so now that you've got um, the eggs in the cup, the cup into um, the jug, you'll then need to add just one teaspoon of butter. So I'd say about that much it goes in there and then just add like the tip of the teaspoon like that then add a tiny little bit of salt so I'd say like that much You're not too salty uh, literally just like one forward and one over so like that then you'll need to add the same with pepper not too much otherwise you don't want it to be so I'm saying about looks like that. Now next step is to mix it, but with a fork, not with a spoon, otherwise it will just be. So now you're gonna mix it up, nice, so it's nice and like not all like lumpy. But if there's still like lumps of butter in there once you've done mixing, that's fine because all the butter will melt in the microwave. is a mess but it doesn't really matter so all of my things are there but so I'm just gonna open it oh yeah we've got um cacao powder in here I, d I don't know why but we keep cacao powder in the microwave so now we need to add this in see how there's the chunks of butter yeah well, that's fine because this will all melt in the microwave see now we need to put it on to number three let that heat up. Now we need to get the toast in and quickly. So I'd say two slices of bread to go in. Okay, as you can hear, that's going on. Now, uh, don't you hear like a? Well, that's a sign of to check it. Mix it up. See how that's starting to form around the edges? Yeah, that's how you want it to look at the end. So just give it a bit of a mix. Then we need to put it back in the microwave and let it 
Thank you, sir. So now the best thing to do is is to get your plate out now. So yeah. There's lots of the crackling in there, but that's alright, because it means that it's cooking. Right, that smells like a good morning. I'm gonna double check it. Wow, that is shot up quite quickly. So look at this egg. It's shot up quite quickly, hasn't it? It's still a bit more like egg that needs to be cooked, but see? That's how it should really look like once it's really out. Anyway, don't put it on your plate. So, see, that now looks like a pie. And that's how we want it to look like. Like a nice egg pie. So now we need to get our toast out. Oh no. For a smart burning, if your toast burns, that's alright because that's what you have a knife for. Scrape off all the burn. Or if you can't be bothered, just put another bit of toast in, which I will do. Even if that's wasted toast, I will actually to give this to the bag. <laughs> So we decided to order to make things easier. We were for the wrong day, so now we have to fill our sandwiches just to lap it into the chair. So I just you hand it to me, Cheshire. Just taking our sandwiches. So I put only like one slice of it in the bin, but that's all right. So uh, well, you always have to taste the egg when it comes out first. I should have done that before. Making Victoria sponges for this afternoon. Which ones to get in? Decorating shelves. Mm. Now, getting together to enjoy baking our tarts. The bottom might look. Or grey, and that's all right. That's only because it's only a bit burnt at the bottom. Mm. That's what Peter says, and it's from a toast. Right, come on. An extra bit of toast can go in it. Now, I need to just have a little tidy up. So it's not dirty. So I can now put the bread back in. Because we don't need it. Ow. Spray my own. With that. I'm going to sweep up. Only just a few crumbs in the corner for now. And then I'll do it. 
And we don't want to get paid to put the sound on. Well, I need to pay for the sound. We don't want to pay for the sound at the moment. Because, yeah. So, this egg is gorgeous. So, it, it, isn't this just a simple recipe? I might actually put it in for a bit longer because that does taste a bit dry. But if you want to taste a bit dry, you need to put it on for like one more minute. Or like 10 seconds. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. I thought the thing was going to burst then. Let's see how that's like frozen up now. Is it wrong? Good time. Check on my toast. Oh, I put it up at the wrong time. I just want to eat breakfast. So, Phoebe, stop eating this egg. Mm. Right, just leave it now. See how it's all grey? But yeah. So it's only the grey inside because I might have either put too much pepper in or it's either burnt. Right, yeah, I put my, oh, that's hot. I put my toast up at the right time, not at the wrong time. So my egg is still warm, which is good. Now I need to butter. Let's get butter and just put the butter on your toast. This could take you a while to do if like if like you have a sore hand or something like I don't I've got loads of hand today. So yeah. But Alexis is for coming around today, I think. Like ten o'clock. So she me and her could like make something or like we could make like, scones or we could make pasta, all that sort of stuff. So we're not bored in the day. So we can film for you. You want to see Alexis, don't you? you? You haven't seen Alexis before. You've only seen me before. So Alexis, she's on my profile picture. Um, and yeah. So. Yeah, so you've never seen Alexis before, I think. But like she's dead funny and you will like her, I promise. She can cook, but she can't really cook like like lots of things, but I can cook lots of things. Now, once you've buttered your butter toast, you're gonna put your egg on top. And then you need to Cut it in half, cut the egg in half, not the toast, cut the egg in half with like your fork or something. So then you've got a bit of egg on each bit of toast. And now you've got scrambled egg and toast. Oh yeah, and if it's grey inside, that's fine. It's only because you've either added too much pepper or it's just a bit burnt, but it still tastes the exact same. Now I think we should do a taste test. So let's go ahead and do a taste test. Oh, I'm, I'm excited about this. That's a plant, it's not. Right, I don't really like, well, I like the crust, but I don't like it when it's really a, like a flaky crust. 
I was gonna go like that, but I've got two forks. Um, Got a knife and a fork now, but it's a butter knife. I always use a butter knife, and I think everyone else would use. Oh well, I think everyone else would use a butter knife. For um, like dragging something on toast. Right, let's give this a taste. Mmm. You have to try this. Mm. Look how thick that egg is, but it's but it's just a bit grey, remember, because I've either had a bit too much pepper or it's just burned a bit. But it's fine. It still tastes the exact same. Yeah, bye. Please, please, please like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications if you want to. Bye.